Hi guys, Chef Pep here, and uh, today we have a, a shipment in from Louisiana. We have crawfish. They're all alive, as you can see. Now these are beautiful. These are uh, uh, very uh, popular in New Orleans and Louisiana. Um, they're really hard to get in Maine, but every now and again, I, uh, I'm able to get a really nice shipment. Uh, th there's probably uh, two or three hundred of them in here. Um, and I'm going to show you guys what they're all about, how to cook them, uh, what they look like before they cook, the good size, good, healthy, strong ones. They get them from the um, brackish water in the rivers in Louisiana, and they come in the bayou there. So these are very active. As you can see, it's, they don't even want to stay in. Look at these guys here. So this is what they look like. These are really good size ones. These they, they look like little uh, lobsters, actually. They look like baby lobsters. The meat's really sweet on them. You know, you gotta rinse them off really well before you start actually cooking them. And you use a really nice um, Cajun uh, cooking seasoning and cut up onions and you cut up lemons and you can cook them with corn and potatoes. Uh, that's the Cajun Louisiana way. I'm gonna do it a little different. I'm gonna use the Cajun seasoning. Look at this big guy. He really wants to come out. I'm gonna use some Cajun seasoning and I'm gonna go ahead and cook all of these up. I have my big stock pot here I'm gonna use. It's a huge pot. Uh, I'm gonna rinse these all down and we're gonna have to do a um, little segmented videos here to show you uh, The progress of how these actually come out. They're really sweet if you love lobster you like shrimp You'll really like these there's different dishes that you can cook with these There's a really nice uh, a famous a uh, sauce that we make using uh, the shells and the body of these guys called an autouffee and it's French It's a beautiful creamy rich sauce. It's almost like a bisque, but not quite uh, it's, it's, it's one of the things that they use in your fancier restaurants in Louisiana. Uh, but th those are the things that you can do with the crayfish. But I really like these guys. They're gonna, they're gonna, they look like they're gonna run and take over my house. So what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna get them ready. I'm gonna, as soon as this water comes to a boil, I'm gonna cut up about probably a whole bag of onions, uh, some garlic. Uh, there's, I won't name any of the brands. There's different brands that you can use. Um, there's a lot of like what they call an Old Bay or a Zatarain's uh, Cajun sauce. I won't tell you what I'm going to use. It's going to be one of these sauces, uh, powdered mix and a little liquid mix, and that's going to uh, make it really, really good. And I'll show you exactly how you cook these. You, you have to bring your water to a boil, and you have to um, let them cook for a good 15 minutes. Uh, once the water comes to a boil, you, you, you let them cook for like maybe 5-10 minutes with this amount. And then you let them sit and soak in the water for a good 30 minutes. That's the way that I've always done it. And that's the way a lot of the, the, the Cajun chefs that really know how to cook these uh, guys cook them. So these are really, really good. There's a little bit of meat in the claws. But all the real good tasty meat is right here in the tail. That tail, it's just like a lobster tail. And once it's cooked, it's easy to kind of get into. I'll show you a little more as the, the video progresses. But uh, I really want you to get, uh, guys to enjoy seeing how these guys come out because they're going to come out really nice. But this is what they look like, guys. These are traditional, authentic Louisiana crawfish. And a lot of those guys call them crawdads. This is them. So enjoy the video. We'll see you guys once we get them cooked. Thank you.